Hi. Today I'd like to show you how you can automatically affect program changes. In this case, using the Event X with the use of some music software on an iPad via MIDI Bluetooth. My music app in this case is called Unsung version 2020. First of all, I have triggers programmed on the page on the right side of my iPad. The top left is a start, stop. The top right is intro three, start, stop. And the middle right is registration. More about that in a second. You see on the left side of the iPad, I have a list, a set list of 158 songs I currently use when I'm performing. When I press one of the titles, the lyrics and chords, or the sheet music for that particular song appears on the right side of the screen. At the same time, a program change is automatically made selecting one of the registrations I've created on the Event X. Some registrations have embedded backing tracks. Let me demonstrate. I'm first going to put the event in registration mode by pressing the middle right side of my screen. Next, I'm going to press a song in my song set and you'll see the event X change automatically to that registration. To start that song, I can press the top left corner of my iPad. And to use ending three, I press the top right of the iPad. I also have embedded backing tracks. Let me demonstrate that. You can enlarge the screen by simply pressing on it on the Event X, and that enlarges that screen. I also have the chords and the lyrics on the right, which I play from, also singing. I can stop this by hitting the top left, as such. I hope you enjoy this video and uh, get some ideas, uh, which you may want to uh, use in the future. Thanks for watching.